Good morning, everyone. Sons and daughters of God, September 19th, defenders of the faith. Jude 1 verse 3 says, you should earnestly contend for the faith which was once delivered unto the saints. Crime of every type is increasing in the world and the earth is defiled under the inhabitants thereof. The eternal plans of God are about to be fulfilled and the end of all things is at hand. This is a time when those who have a knowledge of the truth of God should be ranging themselves on the side of the bloodstained banner of Prince Emmanuel. They should stand forth as defenders of the faith delivered to the saints. They should make manifest to the world what it is to keep the commandments of God and have the faith of Jesus. They should let their light shine forth in clear, strong rays upon the pathway of those who walk in darkness. The soldiers of Christ should stand shoulder to shoulder, loyal to truth, vindicators of the law of Jehovah. Those who depart from the plain precepts of God will support error and be ranged against the soldiers of Christ. They will make manifest who is their leader by the course they will pursue in opposing the truth of God and in enforcing error on the conscience by oppressive measures. It is now time to take a decided stand on the side of truth. And as God has given to everyone his measure of influence, he should exert it to the glory of God and for the good of his associates. Not one of the faithful stewards of Christ will be idle in such a time as this or will be content to live simply for self. Those who are in communion with Christ will realize that there are souls on every side who may be benefited by their help, example, and influence. They will realize that they may be agents through whom Jesus will work to save those from, for whom he died. This should be the experience of all who pro profess to believe the third angel's message in Revelation. Young and old should have a rich, joyful, abundant experience in the religion of Christ. I pray you have a blessed day. You are a son and daughter of God.